Hello, everyone. Thanks for listening. If you're returning, thanks for coming back. And if you're new here, in my previous videos, I've been talking about an engine that I believe would change electrical theory. So if you haven't, please take a look at them. But in this video, I'm going to do a bit of a recap as to where I've come from and where I plan to go with this. Now, I first started chasing down this concept of zero point energy a few years ago but I hadn't started posting on YouTube in, until about a year. And so in my first videos, I was explaining what I was seeing within this movement of energy. And in one of my videos, I asked Elon for his specific opinion. Now at the time, a few days later, he had posted a video or a song, an EDM song, Don't Doubt Your Vibe. And at the time, asking him about my electronic discharge machine, I thought there was quite a synchronization there and, and so decided to continue to move forward even though I never did get a direct response. So while at the time I was building a physical prototype, a, a model, I was in a different place and it took some time to realize that I wasn't gonna be able to finish it there. And so once that process evolved, uh, I decided to pick up a computer and put my thoughts into it and as I started to draw the system out the connections began to make a lot more sense and as I started chasing down these connections I exposed myself to additional papers including Miguel Alcubierre's paper on warp drive and the speed of light and recently in November uh, an additional paper was written that reaffirmed exactly what I was seeing in, in terms of this energy moving in, in both lines and in, and in waves and in, in fields and that there was this oscillation taking place. And so at the time I wrote a patent and did a paper in hopes of getting some exposure to even the concept of the design of zero point energy. But the obvious hurdle I'm going to be facing is the first principle understanding of Maxwell's equations in understanding displacement current as negative energy. If we can use the time varying field to explain displacement current, then we can use it to explain uh, the ability to use capacitors and their time varying discharge to unlock it. But to be able to do this, I'm going to need to put the design into a computer aided engineering program that's going to allow me to simulate the desired effects. Now, a little while ago, I did try to get an Ask Elon campaign going, but wasn't really successful with that. And so, I, last few months, I've been trying to uh, figure out a means in, in order to get the financing that I'm going to need in order to build that simulation. But, as fate would have it, during that time that I was trying to figure out the financing, a path to financing, Elon both announced a $100 million dollar competition and asked himself about the Carnot efficiency to the universe. Now Elon is no stranger to unusual posts but this one in particular did confuse a lot of people. Uh, people didn't really understand what he was talking about but there were some people that understood the Carnot efficiency as a thermal engine, something that operates on the scale of the efficiency of the universe, uh, something that seems to resemble exactly what I'm talking about. So at this point, I really can't tell if this is just a glitch in the system, if it's a, some sort of synchronicity, or if Elon's just messing with me. But when I've been asking Elon for many months about my thermal electric design and he posts about the Carnot efficiency it's something I can't really turn away and, and so it's going to lead me to my next part and that's going to be trying to get the funding or financing for this and 
with that, it leads me to the launch of 369 Token. So 369 Token is going to be used as a means to allow me to continue to explore the idea of zero point energy and be able to afford the research and development as well as potentially the production of a new electrical current. And so a few months ago I put a post out in search of a programmer that could help me create my own Ethereum token and it sparked some philosophical debate about whether Bitcoin or Ethereum were going to be the ultimate winners. And I was arguing the point that Ethereum allows businesses the ability to make contracts with their accounts payable and accounts receivable and allowing these contracts to get in moments of arbitrage where there's a profitable person on either side of a trade that facilitates liquidity or movement in either direction. Now typically these are the things that move markets are supply and demand uh, based on certain fundamentals of a particular product production of, of something but it seems the more that our central banks print money the more we lose any type of reality from what money was truly meant to be now in my white paper for 369 token i've outlined four stages that i'm going to go through in order to try to find not only the cost of creating zero point energy but the value of it as well because if people are able to provide a 48 billion dollar valuation to a joke then what exactly do you value the potential for zero point energy because if you understand physics and electrical theory and you've read my paper and looked over my design then you'll have to recognize that it truly is the first design engineered to explain negative energy as our displacement current as a current that exists as a phantom current because we simply haven't found the means to unlock it so i hope people can appreciate that i haven't put all the aspects out and there are some significant aspects that still need to be calculated but based on the way the world is today there's not many individuals that would be able to help me on this which is why i've been really singularly focused on elon specifically and, and so hopefully one day i'll get his attention and, and he'll see and and i'll be able to get his opinion at least on my design but until then you can visit my website 369energy.com i've got my paper both dark and white paper there you can read them over and if you have any questions about my design please feel free to ask elon if he sees the car not efficiency within it